So what should be the beginning of understanding Dhamma as not self? The point is all Dhammas are Dhammas, no one at all, no self, no thing in it. But it has to be the understanding a little clearer of what is appearing now. Otherwise, it's like not understanding reality, keep on and not understanding, not understanding, just hearing about it. But the truth is that listen about whatever we can hear, can hear now to understand the truth, such a of this very moment as it is. Otherwise, it cannot let go the idea of self at all. It's not the matter should when there is awareness. Even how can awareness arise? By I, by anyone, or if there's no intellectual understanding, there's no conditions at all for bright awareness to arise and be aware with understanding of what has heard been for. Otherwise, it cannot conform what is heard and what appears now. So it's not, a, it's not the matter of should there be this or that at that very moment, but to understand that which is hidden for years and years ago, not appear to understanding as it is, until hearing the teaching, developing understanding, and when the conditions are right, ready to condition a moment of right awareness, it shows its characteristic is nature as no one at all, only that very reality which arises too aware. So it's a matter of the truthful, such a by me, just hearing any words about whatever appears now until there are conditions enough for a moment of direct understanding, naturally, unexpectedly, beyond will or desire or intention at all. And this is the way to let go. The other way, try to let go, is not the way to let go. That is why one can understand what's meant by the part of me, not just one year or two years or one life. It takes more than years and years to develop the firm confidence on no one now. Reality cannot be changed into anything. It has its own characteristic and it just conditioned to be there and then all gone completely. Sunyata, never at all, never be again at all never to return at all. And this is the only way to develop understanding. By understanding, little by little, until it's time not to forget that now it's not me at all. No matter what, thinking arises and falls away, not me. Hearing, considering, liking, disliking, hardness, softness, all appear when there are conditions and then gone completely, never to return to the only way, which is the makkah, lead to understanding deeper and deeper, penetrate the truth of it, which is now is hidden all the time from moment to moment. That's why we begin to understand the meaning of kanti. Not just to be kanti to wrong uh, understanding or harsh word or, or akusa, but to develop the understanding of not me, no I at all. It's gone. Everything is gone immediately. And then the other arises. So there's no penetration to the moment of the let to the moment of a fallen way of the previous one. 